What's up folks? Good morning. Hey man, we're out here gonna do some winter crappie fishing and uh, to get started I'm just gonna go right into my loop knot because uh, three pound fishing tackle jig head right through the eyelet because uh, we're getting set up We're gonna put some big fish in the boat today sniping braid. We're gonna swing that bad boy around Put it right back through the loop that you held and bam right there I've got an awesome loop knot right there and that's a 30 second ounce jig head right there that's a 30 second jig ounce jig head right there we're gonna trim it up put like a number seven split shot on there which again looking for a solution for that because I still don't think that's a great idea but the guide trips are always will tell you this is awesome handy little guy I got all the different weights that you need for crappie fishing all in one little do deal right there um, and uh, I just attach it straight to the snaping braid. Now, I don't use a leader, as a lot of people know. See how that hangs just perfectly? It doesn't get better than that. And uh, we put that split shot right on the sniping braid. We use our teeth, which, of course, is not good for you. I do not recommend that. And that's what I fish with right there. That's about a foot and a half, two feet. And uh, let's go put some fish in the boat. And if you don't think that doesn't pop, that's crazy. That's crazy how that pops. A lot of great feedback on that so far. It's amazing. So, all right, fish in the boat. Let's do it. All right, folks. So, today's topic is definitely going to be winter fishing. We are in the winter time now. It's gotten cold. We found a nice, quiet little cove here, so we don't have the wind knocking on us. It's a uh, it is 30 degrees right now, so we're, we're past the first wave of holiday season. Thanksgiving was fantastic, and uh, we are going to put some fish in the boat. So winter fishing, we're going to do active captain as well here. We're going to get right to the active captain if we've got fish on this pile here. But uh, what's the difference between winter fishing? At least for me, I do almost exactly the same stuff, except for a lot of these fish have separated from the piles, that type of stuff. Um, I do a lot more chasing in the wintertime, schools of fish, and uh, I don't necessarily have to go right to the piles. Oh, somebody touched it. Our first guest on three pound fishing today, folks, is right here. Good fish. He's good fish right there. That's winter fishing. That's dropping vertically down on him. Look at that. Bam. That's a good fish. You like that. Customer number two on three pound fishing, baby. Oh, so we tried a little vertical fishing with the hair jig and then we go back to the, uh, the swim bait and there it is. Sniping braid is just slicing through the water column. Let me show you some active captain real quick. There seems to be a lot of fish right here. I have an 8612 which allows me to do active captain, which is incredible. If you don't, if you haven't tried it, you should. Um, you get an app on your phone basically, and those videos go straight to your phone, which makes it really easy to download to your, your computer. For those of the people that like the video that catches. So active captain is gonna start one, two, three. We're at 14.6, 14.0. So, there you go, there's a pile. That's actually a stump with a lot of fish on it. Look at that, they're just stacked right there. All right, right there. There it is. I'm telling you folks, that fish just barely touched it and I could feel it. Unbelievable. So, good fish, good little eater. Right there, good fish right there. Letting them go. You don't keep no fish on three pound fishing, folks. Guide service, the guide trips have been crushing it, man. Winter fishing, the fall 
is uh, winter fishing in the fall is it's just it's just it's something special. It is truly something special. Come a little short there. If I have a bad cast, I don't I don't waste my time with it. I bring it right back in, and these guys are just stacked up in here. A lot of times I just play the wind, and I'll do that on most any lake. If I see the wind is, has been pretty consistent in a direction, I'll go to those points that that wind is blowing into. Um, couple that with some structure. Good night. I missed two bites, by the way. And there's one right there. That's a better fish, too. He fighting. He fighting. That's a better fish. Gosh dang. Well, I am right there. So, a little gear check just so that we can talk about a little bit. Three pound fishing tackle jig heads. That bait hook is on the opposite side. It's a medium gauge hook, so it will bend just a little bit and you can bend it right back, but it won't break. It's not thin wire, which that's, I love that. Um, Obviously, sniping Bray, three pound fishing elite series. This is a 10 footer from Ozark Rods. Um, get them, Christmas time's right around the corner. Look at that pile, folks. That is awesome stuff. Winter fishing. Kind of got to be a diehard, there's no doubt about that. Got to kind of be a diehard. He's gonna hit it too, watch. There he was, <laughs> he just barely pushed on it. He chased that sucker all the way up there. He just touched it, barely, and I was able to catch that sucker. Bam, that's a good fish right there. That's funny. That is funny. The, uh, a lot of people go into those shorter rods, which I think is awesome. I know that Ozark Rods has a uh, what's called the Mini. That's their 5.6, but they also have some dock shooting rods. The uh, I think it's a 6 and a 7 footer. Check those out if you're into those shorter rods. Um, those suckers are really nice and light. Um, it just, you know, I, I, who knows, we might end up coming out with one for three pound fish and a seven footer, but I, I really want it to be a little stiffer, um, which is what I'm looking for. Um, but either way, the, the minis, a lot of people are really enjoying that mini rod, so that might be a good Christmas gift. Straight up and down. We like it straight up and down. Good fish. Good fish. Like I said, it's always good to move. So we're gonna move. Try something else. Listen to that braid. Is that not freaking awesome? <laughs> That's a better fish. That's a better fish. Bottom lip, man. Right there. Good fish. Right now I can tell you that I am actually freezing. I am cold. I am very cold. I don't have my bibs on. I don't know why. I'm being lazy. Stop being lazy. Man, we have been having some fun on the guy trips. I, I mean, I can't even begin to, I can't begin to tell you. People coming all the way in from Michigan and Iowa and uh, making long trips, it's fantastic. It's really cool. 
It's been in a couple days. Um, Just the guy trips have been fun, man. Just when you're smoking them every day, it's just that's a good fish. It, it doesn't get you better. That's gonna end it. We had a great time on the water. Winter fishing. That's a good fish. Winter fishing doesn't get any better. Give me a holler if you're interested in getting in the boat. Fish will be going in the boat with us. Three pound fishing, baby. Have a great holiday season. Thanks for watching Three Pound Fishing, partnered up with these fantastic companies.